Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emily Freibler. I make new videos every single week on affordable beauty and fashion. And today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the Shark Hyper Air Hair Dryer. And I am so excited to share this with you guys. I've been trying it out for the last couple of weeks and I can't wait. So let's go ahead and get started with this hair dryer review. So I'm going to be showing clips of me using the hair dryer because I did get a lot of different attachments and I want to show you guys how awesome the attachments are. Um, so I'm going to start out. I did get the premium bundle and I got it directly from the sharkbeauty.com website, but this is available at like uh, Bed Bath & Beyond and Best Buy and all that kind of stuff. The only reason I got it directly from Shark is I wanted every single attachment in like a bundle and otherwise I would have had to get attachments separately and I didn't want to do that for, for like multiple ones. I will, I will say I think you might be able to use like a 20% off coupon and stuff like that at Bed Bath & Beyond. So you can kind of like decide what kind of attachments you want from this and then see what price point or which bundle to get. This is the hair dryer. It looks very similar to the Dyson. And to be honest, the reason I got this hair dryer, well, first of all, I needed a new hair dryer. I had had mine for like, oh my gosh, probably like eight years. I've had it for forever, probably all of college. And I've been out of college for four years now. So like, it's, it's time. So, I wanted the Dyson, as I feel like everyone does, the Dyson Airwrap, but that thing is so expensive, you guys. Like, I just could never justify it. And then I saw someone talking about this on Instagram, and I was like, oh my gosh. First of all, Dyson is a, like, they started out with vacuums and fans and, like, all that kind of stuff, and then went into the hair game, and Shark is the exact same way. And both of them claim to, you know, reduce heat damage, have like hardly any heat damage, and then also be styling tools. And that really, really intrigued me. Um, the other thing about this is this hair dryer with all of the attachments, if you're not going to get any money off from coupons, which usually even on the Shark website, they either have like $20 off or like 10% off, which is what I did. Without all of that, it's $250. And I believe the Dyson is like five something to get the uh, air wrap one. That's like crazy. So this is half the price. Um, still an amazing quality hair dryer and Shark, like my mom has had Shark um, vacuums and stuff that just like work amazingly for a really long time. So I'm not worried about this like crapping out on me or anything like that. So sorry, I'm just going through all the reasons why I wanted to get this hair dryer and then we'll go through like the claims and all that kind of stuff. The other reason I wanted this is because I love my Revlon hair dryer brush thing, but honestly, that thing gets really hot. It can be damaging to the hair and I don't like to use it all of the time. Uh, so this has an attachment that is so similar to that and I can't wait to share it with you guys. This is the hair dryer. On the back here, it does have all of the like um, speed and heat settings. So, um, the hair dryer, when you attach a specific attachment, it will go to a heat setting that is like set. I don't know how it knows this, but like it knows, oh, with this attachment, I should go at this heat setting and this speed. You can adjust that. And then I have found that at least when I'm it, while it's still plugged in, I haven't like noticed, I guess, after this, it'll stay at that heat setting, even if you're like turning it off, which is great for like a diffuser because when I'm diffusing my hair, when I wear it curly, I like to turn, I like to have it off when I put my hair in it, turn it on, leave it for a while, and then turn it off and then put it back down. And if I had to keep changing the heat setting, that would be so annoying. Those are on the back, and then all you have here is the cool shot button. So that's literally all that's on the hair dryer, and um, it has a nice long cord like this. I think it looks really sleek. And anyway, that's a hair dryer. With the hair dryer. By itself, I did get all these attachments and one of them is this concentrated nozzle and it's pretty cool because you can do, it says like this is the pre-styler side and this is the precision style. So this is something you would use with like a round brush or something like that to really like, you know, get a nice sleek style. So to do the precision side, this thing just slides back and forth and do you see this pushing out there? That's gonna get it a more concentrated uh, line that comes out of here. So my camera stopped recording. It's a different day, obviously, and 
Let's continue with this review. I'm sorry about this, you guys. So, so we got through the concentrated nozzle. That one I haven't used too much because I've been using this attachment that kind of replaces like a round brush. Obviously, you can get different results um, depending on the different round brushes or whatever you use with the concentrated nozzle. But this is definitely my absolute favorite attachment for the whole like line. I have the Revlon um, styling brush and I love that. But the problem with that one is at least the, the model that I have, I think there might be a new model. You only have like high and low and you don't have like heat settings and all that different stuff. With this one, obviously you can change the heat settings. You can change the speed of everything. And I really, really like this. And obviously it's way smaller. Like I wouldn't have to have a regular hair dryer and then also the hair dryer brush because the hair dryer brush I didn't like to use on soaking my hair one it took too long and also it's damaging on your hair so for this one I start out by just drying my hair to probably about 80 percent dry and then I'll put on this attachment and again all you do is snap these on until it does a little tiny click and the cool thing about this is Obviously, this isn't a straight handle like those hair dryer brushes are, but this one does swivel. So you just push this little butt brush here. So obviously it locks into place when you move it. Um, most of the time I like to have mine vertical. So I like to have it like this and then I can go through and brush the hair. It's just a lot easier that way. Like when I'm going on top, I can rotate my wrist like this because the whole point of this is these hard bristles. Sorry, there's hair on this. The hard bristles um, comb through the hair, but then the soft bristles right here are what give your hair that nice like shine and really create that smooth look. So with this brush, I will show you obviously clips of me using this and everything. I can get my hair done in a little bit under 15 minutes from completely soaking wet, stepping out of the shower to completely styled. And the reason it takes that, you know, it's not 10 minutes is because I do section off my hair with these hair clips that actually came with the bundle. So these are amazing like alligator clips. Honestly, I was kind of like, oh, it's just thrown in, you know, with the premium bundle that I got from Shark. I believe that's the only place that you can get these like clips and also this little heat mat um, that you set on your counter, which to be honest, I don't really use this, but these clips are amazing. You literally just go like this and clip it up and it keeps everything in place. You can do your whole entire head. I did a hair mask last night and I wrapped up my entire hair and just used one of these. It's super strong and amazing. I don't know if you could even buy these separately, but it's if you are gonna get the premium bundle from Shark, just know that these are really great. The fact that I can do my hair in under 15 minutes is freaking amazing. I don't think I've ever been able to do that because even with a regular hair dryer, my hair is very thick and it's hard to get it to dry quickly. So this hair dryer is a lifesaver when it comes to time and I'm in love with that part of it. So this brush head will completely replace my Revlon brush. I'm gonna get rid of it because I don't need it anymore. The next product that I actually used yesterday and today is the diffuser. Again, you just clip this on here very easy and the thing I love about this compared to the Dyson obviously I don't have the Dyson but just pictures videos everything like that and I've seen a lot of curly girls raving about the shark one versus the Dyson because of the size of the bowl so I had actually purchased a diffuser from Amazon I can't remember what it's called for like 20 25 bucks and it is amazing it has a big bowl like this but this one's even better than that one because the air actually comes out of the little tongs right here which makes it amazing to get into your roots so like when you pull your hair like this and you go into your roots you can literally just place it on your roots and it'll dry your roots as well as drying the other parts of your hair and the cool thing about this is a, like similar to um the concentrated nozzle is you can adjust how the tong thing, how far the tong things go up, I guess the prongs. Um, so where I have it now is the lowest setting and that is for like, let's see, it says for shorter hair and styling ends. So if you just wanna get your ends done and you've already like hover diffused or something and gotten your roots, then 
you can um, just have it lower like that. You can obviously have it in the middle of any of these. Um, but then this is where it's all the way up and it can really penetrate into your roots. I obviously still like to hover diffuse with this, but it also is kind of nice having these out when I hover diffuse because it really can get closer without creating that frizz or whatever. So today I have day two hair. So yesterday I did a hair mask, washed my hair, styled it, diffused it, everything like that. And this morning, like my hair when I sleep on it is just not good. That's a whole nother story. Anyway, so today I did a curl refresh. That's why it's a little more frizzy and stuff. And I wet it down and then diffused it like this. And it's, it's like so, so good. You guys, another thing, obviously you can change the controls on it really, really easily. That's why I like that they're back here because I feel like I can just um, control it better than having them right here, which I never thought was going to be a big thing, but it actually is a lot easier and I don't have to look at it. So the diffuser is amazing. I can dry my hair. I think, I can't remember how long it was. I might have said it in this video, but I think it was like 20 minutes or something like that to completely diffuse my hair, which is unheard of for my hair, like soaking wet. It's literally insane, which also means I can wear my hair curly more again, because for me, it was just the time consuming part of diffusing and all of that stuff. Who wants to sit there and diffuse for like 30, 40 minutes? Not me. The premium bundle does come with this, which is the waiver, I believe. I can't remember exactly what it's called. I know this contraption looks absolutely insane, but this was actually one of the reasons I wanted to get this hair dryer. And it's good. It's just not great I guess if that makes sense with you guys um I do have a demonstration video and I do like the results the only issue is one I feel like there's a little bit of a learning curve and two like you have to use small sections with this thing to get the desired results and that just takes more time personally I'm faster at a curling iron so it's not like something I would reach for all the time. That is one thing that is tricky. It's also tricky to know is your hair like dry enough or not, how long to keep it in there because you can't touch the hair while it's in here. Um, basically how you use this, so you can curl left and you can curl right. Um, and you just flip this switch, which is actually really nice compared to like something like the Dyson where you have to take the um, brush or not brush, the barrel off of it every time you want to switch directions. I've never used that one before, but I will say I, I've seen results from that. The results for that are better than this, which is disappointing because I know Shark was trying to do something a little bit similar to the Dyson with this, but I think this is where they fell short. The other attachments are A++ for me, but if you're looking solely to get this hair dryer for this purpose, which I was thinking about, Unfortunately, I would not recommend it. Um, you can watch me do it, but you have to hold each piece for like 20 to 30 seconds to get it to hold the curl and dry and all that stuff. And especially if you have long hair, which I think probably would be an issue with the Dyson as well, this isn't gonna work as much because the ends kind of get snarly. You kind of have to move it up and down as you are using it. And so, yeah, it's a little bit disappointing. Obviously for travel too, it'd be bulky as crap. Look, look at this. So basically what you do, I was showing that video as well. You clip it on here and then you just put your piece of hair in here while it's on and it like vacuums it in here and starts wrapping it around this little pole that's on the inside here. And that's how it creates your curl. Again, I do wanna play around with it a little bit more. I've used it a few times. I did it for this video um, and a few times before that, but yeah, I don't know. Right now, I don't think it's worth it. Maybe in the future, I'll start using it a lot and I'll come back and be like, oh my gosh, you guys, I was so wrong. But I don't know, right now, I don't think it's, uh, worth it. If you're going to buy from somewhere and you want th these two attachments, I personally would recommend going to sharkbeauty.com because like I said, you can't get these two solely together anywhere else. You can get it with the singled out like um, concentrated nozzle. But the problem here is that I'm pretty sure most places don't do coupons. Um, I've been doing a little bit more research since, you know, I filmed the last bit and the only place that I've seen that accepts coupons for it is sharkbeauty.com. 
and you should do if you're gonna do those two get the premium bundle you get an extra attachment even if you don't think you're gonna use this all that much it's gonna be cheaper because the the ones where you get these two in the concentrated nozzle are 250 everywhere that i've seen bed bath and beyond best buy like everywhere they're 250 now at shark the attack the bundle that i got the premium bundle with that includes this and the clips and the little mat is 250 but they have a like beauty 20 code which is pretty good but don't do that one do the 10 percent off one because that will get you even a little bit more money off i think it's another five dollars so even with tax and shipping and stuff it will be cheaper if not like you know just maybe like five dollars or something but you get an extra attachment and then also um it's just a little bit cheaper than the original one you know what i'm saying so unless you really want it in like two days from amazon or something like that go ahead and order it from sharpbeauty.com overall this hair dryer is amazing i have used this so 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 much since I got it and I'm in love with it. I think it is 100% worth it price wise. I think it's priced very right compared to the Dyson, which is like twice as much as this. I highly recommend and I hope you guys, guys like this video. If you get the hair dryer, please let me know on Instagram. My handle is Emily Freibler, just of my first and last name. I will leave it right here. Go follow me over there as well. I share a lot more updates and different things like that on my Instagram. So I hope you guys like this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. I upload new videos every single week on affordable beauty and fashion. I would love to have you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss another video and that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in video very, very soon. How many times can I say video? Oh God.